Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. In this one, I wanna do a comparison between free and paid AI art, AI image generators. On the paid side, we've got the just released Mid Journey version 5.2. They just did the 5.2 update. And on the free side, we're gonna look at SDXL 0.9 or Stability Diffusion XL. 0.9. They're both great. Mid Journey is, I guess, the heavyweight, the gold standard, so to speak, but SDXL looks pretty damn good too. How are we going to do the comparison? Simple. I'm going to put this prompt here. I'm going to create a random AI art prompt generator. So it's just going to create prompts for me, and then I'm going to run it in both. We'll do a quick comparison. Keep in mind, one's free, one's paid. All right, let's get going. All right, so what did I do? I just said, I want you to be a random prompt generator for an AI art generator. Redundancy. I will give you a word and you give me a prompt based on that word. Can you do that? This is in chat GPT-4, as you can see up here at the top. So the first one I want is a portrait. I want to compare portraits between Midjourney and SDXL. So I'm going to put the exact same prompt into both. I'm going to do that. I'm going to run them. We'll see what we get. All right, welcome back. So let's look at the free version. This is on clipdrop.co. This is SDXL 0.9, and it has done an amazing job. Look at this. Wow, look at that. I mean, let's just flip through a couple of them. I will note here up front that there was quite a lineup for them, so uh, this wasn't... So yeah, look at that. That's fantastic. Uh, let's take a look at one more, maybe. Uh, this one looks... Uh, this one looks different. Let's try that one. I mean, really, really good stuff. Let's take a quick flip over here to, uh, we're going to go over to Discord and look in Midjourney. Again, really great stuff. Midjourney, let's click on these ones. I mean, these are a little more detailed if you ask me, and there's a bit more going on in the images. But overall, I think they've both done a great job, especially for this type of portrait. Um, also note that I have this set to 16-9 uh, aspect ratio by default, and the... SDXL is set to a square by default, although I believe they're quite high resolution. So there you go. And if you want this one, this one's free. You can just go up here, wait for it to load, and then click download HD and done. Again, totally free. Let's take a look at the next one. All right. So the next one's going to be for landscape type images. And it gave me a fantastical landscape that fuses elements of classical Renaissance paintings with futuristic sci-fi cityscapes. Now, how awesome is that? That is a great prompt. Let's go back. I'm going to go right into, let's go into clip drop here. We're going to go back to SDXL. As you'll see here, again, it says SDXL. And I'm just going to type it in and hit and hit go. Do note that I'm going to apply no style, but if you want a particular style like digital art or maybe a neon punk or a low poly or any of these things, you can click on this button and it will give you that option. I'm just going to go in raw dog and here we go. I'm going to click generate on that one. And then I'm going to go over again. I'm going to skip this. Do note, again, there's a big lineup, so there's like 400 images ahead of me. So I'm going to have to go quickly through this and come back. And then I'm going to go into Discord, and I'm going to go forward slash imagine. And then I'm going to copy and paste in the exact same prompt. And then I'm going to let them both run, come back when they're done. All right, welcome back. Look at these shots. Holy smokes. I'm going to click on that image. That is absolutely fantastic. And again, I know I said this twice, but this is completely free. This is amazing look at that look at these shots uh, let's take a look at oh my god these this one here looks pretty damn good again if i want to use this i can just go ahead and click on download and presto i've got it um you can also do a few other things here you can do clean up imperfections you can relight it enhance upscale all sorts of things what the heck what does relight even look like um uh yeah okay yeah we're just going to continue on but i do want you to note that that is there so if you want to pay for it it's there. All right, let's go back over to Discord. Let's see what we came up with in Midjourney. Again, more awesome images. Although, you know, if I'm being honest, I almost prefer the style out of SDXL. I don't. What do you guys think? Like, this is pretty wild. Like, I mean, these are great. Don't get me wrong, but the, the SDXL stuff was that was really really good. So I don't know, guys. There you go. I'm gonna run some more. I'm gonna do some 3D animations. A 3D hamburger, I'm going to do an illustration, and then I'm going to package that up. You don't need to see me go through the process anymore, but they will be in the thumbnail. Try out SDXL. Let me know what you think. Which one do you think is better? Leave a comment. Thanks for watching.